Let's talk about the Rams, Cooper Cup and Robert Woods. Uh, they are drastically different spots on this list. Cooper Cup is the wide receiver three in fantasy usage and wide receiver one as we sit here right now in fantasy points. Robert Woods all the way down at wide receiver 22 usage, wide receiver 38 in fantasy points. We talked about it. This offense has been opened up more because of Matthew Stafford and Sean McVay. The player that is benefiting the most is Cooper Cup, even though that these two players were drafted kind of neck and neck all fantasy draft season long. Do you have a reason why Cooper Cup would be dominating over Robert Woods? Like that's like what I keep going back to. Right now, Cooper Cup has a 38% target share. We've seen these guys be right next to each other forever. There's not a reason to me at least that why Robert Woods would all of a sudden just be like left in the dust here. So I, I think that right now I'm going to be ranking both Cooper Cup and Robert Woods still very highly. The offense just looks totally different. Like you're just seeing what like McVay's dialing up, like some of these bootleg stuff, like Jared Goff just like flick it for three yards. Right now, like you're getting Matthew Stafford ripping the ball downfield. And that it's been Cooper Cup to start, but like there's no reason for me at least that that can't be Robert Woods coming across on these like deep crossing routes. So uh, I'm still very, very bullish on Robert Woods. I'm not like concerned that Cooper Cup's dominating right now. I think part of it is just how Cooper Cup is being used. He's always kind of been, and this might surprise people, like a pseudo tight end. In a lot of ways, like I know he's always in a two point stance, but pay attention when you watch the Rams, how he's like in a two point stance, really close and attached basically to the offensive tackle and how he's, you know, at times leaving in for blocking systems and sealing off the backside defender. But then Hayden, because he's running far more slot snaps than Robert Woods. I mean, I think Woods has something like uh, 35 on the season and I'm trying to count up right now. Cooper Cup has 68 slot snaps. And so what you've seen in his successful plays, a lot of them are getting isolation with safeties or with cornerbacks one-on-one -on -one down the field. And he's taking those for touchdowns or getting them in the end zone. And we know maybe in comparison to Jared Goff previously, Matthew Stafford is willing to hit those tight window throws. He's willing to give you those chances in those areas and much more willing to extend the A dots of both of those players. I'm with you. I don't expect Cooper Cup to finish as this year's wide receiver one, maybe even as a wide receiver five. But I also, on the same exact sentence and same exact breath, I'll say that I don't expect Robert Woods to finish as the wide receiver 33, much closer to maybe the wide yeah. receiver 24, wide receiver 20. So I think there's going to be some positive improvements from Robert Woods as we go along. Cooper Cup's not going to have a 38% target share this year. And Robert Woods, it's a two two week sample. And I think that. What you're getting, like Cooper Cup dominating and Robert Woods still being like a wide receiver three, that's good news to me. Like you see that there's definitely potential here for Robert Woods. Like I don't know, man. Like this is, seems like a very easy just hold on to Robert Woods. Don't panic. He, he can be like the wide receiver two overall next week, and that would not surprise any of us. The Rams' offense is sick, and Robert right. Woods and, is still good. And this is an offense that isn't going anywhere. You know, in terms yeah. of dipping down, it's it's just going to stay exactly how it is all season long. And so why not get a cheap piece of that in Robert Woods? Now, if I really wanted to nitpick here, Hayden, I would say that Cooper Cup just looks more dynamic with the ball in his hands, looks more athletic right now with the ball in his hands yeah. than Robert Woods, who looks a bit stiff to me, but that's Ooh, just my eyes. And we all, we all, we all see it a little bit differently. We all okay. see a little bit differently. Cooper Cup looks like he's on steroids. Like he looks completely <laughs> jacked. He's like running downhill. He, I've never seen Cooper Cup look this built. It's crazy. Me either. He's 28. Age model? 28. 